Teresa Sue has spent much of her life dedicated to helping the poor. More than 100 years old, Teresa still spends her time reading, learning, meeting people, gathering, and distributing food and money to help the needy. Her organization, Heart to Heart, began in 1929 under the name Friends of the Needy. Here's Teresa. We are very poor and we took food from the earth, sweet potato and bamboo shoots. Then one day we were sitting down to a meal. One woman came with her child and said, we haven't eaten for two days. Please help us. So my mother took things from the table, the thing that we were sitting down to eat, gave it all to them and she said, we ate yesterday, they haven't eaten for two days. They have more right to the food than we. And it was a very good lesson to me. All my life, I think of people who have less than we. It has been my guiding light all my life. Ooh, I started out to earn a different name, Friends of the Needy in 1923. Wherever I go, I do the same thing. I put my back down. First thing I look for is people who don't have enough to eat. And then when I come to Singapore, I call myself Heart to Heart. Heart to Heart is we give whatever we can, food and money for the rent through and help them see the doctor, whatever. We Sometimes people hear my talk, they donate money, we pass it on to those who need. At the moment we have 15 old people in Singapore, 5 families and 34 blind people in Ho Chi Minh City. There was a time when we were very, very poor. I went to the river towards the family clothes and while the clothes were drying on the on the low bush, we went to look for whatever food we can get. I was so hungry, I looked around, nobody was watching. So I stooped down, got a handful of grass and shoved it in my mouth. It didn't satisfy my hunger, at least it satisfied my thought of hunger. So it did taste nice. I didn't stop my hunger, so I said to myself, as long as I am able to let nobody need to eat grass. So this is my guideline now. Whoever is hungry, I do my best to see what I can get for them. Till now, I still do it. I still go around and see who is hungry. I will share my rice bowl, my bowl of rice with you. This is now my life, is to share what I have with those who are hungrier than I. Even equally hungry, we say have a bowl. One man asked me why. Why don't you stay at home, enjoy yourself, instead of going around with 20 people? I said, if I eat food by myself, I alone, ha ha chill. I persuade 20 people, 21 people, ha ha chill. He said, you know, my joy and multiplied 21 times. So six months later, we attended a meeting in the recess, tea time, tea break, he came up to me and he said to me, thank you for teaching me how to smile 21 times. I said, next time we meet, we will smile 42 times. But the 42 times hasn't come yet. So we're waiting for the chance to smile 42 times. In life, there are always problems. You solve your problem to the best you can, accept the rest. Don't think of the problem all the time. Sing, 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 sing. 
and concerns when you had to spend money by handkerchief. Mm. And then you ha ha ha. And then we ha ha. No need to spend money, no handkerchief. A ha is better than sink sink.